Vagus nerve activation is a huge rabbit hole with a lot of information on why it's important for your health and how to do it correctly. In this video, I'll review one of the most high-end vagus nerve stimulation devices out there, the Neurosim. I've used it for quite some time now and want to share my experience with it. So what I liked and what I didn't like. But before we get to the review, let's first talk about why the vagus nerve is so important and how stimulating it can improve your health. The vagus nerve is the longest cranial nerve in your body. It starts on the brainstem and extends through your neck, chest, and abdomen. And it's a key player in your parasympathetic nervous system, which is responsible for things like rest, digestion, and recovery. This is important because it balances the sympathetic nervous system, which controls your fight or flight response. So the exact opposite of the parasympathetic nervous system. When the sympathetic nervous system dominates, which is usually the case, it can lead to all sorts of health issues like high blood pressure, chronic fatigue, low immunity, and chronic inflammation. So balancing these two parts of your nervous system is crucial for your well-being. The problem is that both the sympathetic and the parasympathetic nervous system are part of the autonomic nervous system, which we cannot directly control. You can't just tell your body to not stress out in a stressful situation. It doesn't work like that. But what we can do is stimulate the vagus nerve, which in turn activates your parasympathetic nervous system and then calms down your sympathetic nervous system. Most of the advice you find online on vagus nerve stimulation focuses on things like deep breathing, meditation, or progressive muscle relaxation. Basically anything that helps you relax. These are all great ways to calm down, but there are also electronic devices like Neurosim that can do it for you. They're designed to stimulate the vagus nerve directly using small electrical impulses. This then brings me to the actual review. Neurosim is a transcutaneous vagus nerve stimulation device, so TVNS, which means it works through the skin. After seeing some great reviews online, I researched a bunch of these devices and I decided to reach out to a few manufacturers to see if I could try one of them out for my channel. Only Neurosim responded, but they were nice to send me a free unit. So this is my only vagus nerve stimulation device and I cannot compare it to other devices. Instead, I want to talk about the technology in general and walk you through what I liked, what I didn't like, and whether I recommend it to other people. Like I said before, Neurosim works by sending low frequency electromagnetic pulses to your ear through a little earpiece, which stimulates the vagus nerve. The idea is non-invasive stimulation, so you don't need surgery or an implant, which a lot of older devices required. Daily use of the device then shifts your body out of sympathetic dominance. Basically, it gets you out of the chronic fight or flight mode and into rest and recovery. Using it is also pretty straightforward. All you have to do is one, apply a bit of moisture on the tragus of your left ear, two, clip the earpiece correctly on the tragus of your ear, the cable should go over and behind your ear to keep the electrodes in place. Three, then you just turn it on and slowly increase energy until you feel a light tingling sensation in your ear. This is the sign that the current is flowing and that your vagus nerve is being stimulated. Four, after you hit the enter button, the device will count down from 60 minutes, which is what I use every day. But some people prefer two sessions of 30 minutes. The company recommends doing it in the morning, but it can make you feel somewhat tired, so I didn't like using it in the morning and prefer to use it for 60 minutes in the evening. Also, you can use the device during your normal daily activities. For example, I often cook dinner with it or use it while relaxing on the couch after I'm done with work. Now, before I give you my personal opinion on it, let's quickly talk about the scientific research on these type of devices. Studies have shown positive effects on conditions like depression, anxiety, epilepsy, migraines, sleep disorders, and even chronic issues like long COVID or chronic fatigue. So this is very promising stuff, but of course, the studies often work with different devices, different frequencies, durations, and intensities. So it's hard to compare results directly. If you're curious, Neurosim has a list of studies on their website that were done just with their device. As for my personal experience, I definitely noticed that Neurosim helped me relax more, especially when I had a long day at work. 
The Vegas stimulation is noticeable and it's hard to describe what it feels like. For me, it just helped me relax. But my girlfriend, for example, will instantly get tired when she uses it. Because of that and because it also improves her overall sleep quality, we both still use it every day. Now, of course, there are also a few downsides. The price is pretty steep and it's about as much as a flagship smartphone, which will put some people off. Hopefully, as the technology improves, the price will come down. That being said, the company, of course, has to recover its research and development costs. And as far as I can tell, it is also the device that has most been studied for safety and efficacy with a CE certification from the EU. There is also a 30 day trial, so if you're unsure, you can test it out and send it back if it's not for you. One more drawback was that while the earpiece was fine for me, my girlfriend found it a bit uncomfortable, especially because she has small ears and sometimes it felt like it was slipping off even though it wasn't. Kind of a weird sensation that probably has to do with the way you clip it on to your ear. Okay, with all that being said, do I recommend Nurisim? Yes, with a few caveats. If you've been following my channel, you know I've had my own recovery journey from chronic fatigue syndrome. And it took me years to really understand what was going on with my body and how to heal from it. I developed a four-step healing program that focuses on one, relaxing your nervous system, two, nutrition and supplementation, three, detox practices and lifestyle improvements, and four, reducing toxin exposure. Nurism makes the first step a lot easier. Even though vagus nerve stimulation shouldn't be your only strategy for improving your health, it definitely supports the most important part, relaxing your nervous system and reducing sympathetic dominance. That alone often makes a huge difference in people's lives, especially if their body is so sensitive that they don't tolerate any diet changes or supplements. So my recommendation to you would be to familiarize yourself with all the four steps of healing and then to use Nurism as a targeted tool to improve your nervous system balance, more specifically to get you out of sympathetic dominance. If you are concerned about the price, which I totally understand, you can get a small discount if you use the link in my description and definitely make sure to take advantage of the 30 day trial. Like I said before, most people notice benefits, but there are non responders as well. And you will see if you are one within a few days. So then you can just return the device and we'll get your money back. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.